What's up? They just got to say some more stuff, you know. Just uh, like I said, man, opened it up. Here it comes. Uh, I've been told to hold back on some of the things I've uh, been about to do here. And no, I'm not going to put this information, some information out there directly just yet. It's coming. Uh, I'm just going to hold tight until it's all said and ready. But I'm definitely going to try to get on here you know, every day and just uh, talk a little bit. And I don't know. I think so many people uh, look at me in awe and wonder what the hell and don't understand and confuses them. And so, but uh, that's going to change. You know, I, I know I've been kept in the dark and uh, that was for a purpose. You know, um, the Bible says, and again, I'm not using this to preach, but just for communication purposes, because there's a language and it's common ground we can understand. Because there is a lot of truth in the Bible. A lot of stories are real and there are truths to it and they teach some, but we're going to bring the key in and see what's really going on with it and make it make it real and apply it to this real situation here now not the past not the future now okay because we can spend all day studying what god did and where he's been and whoopty whoopty woo and we know when he's oh, he's supposedly coming back in the future and we gotta you know what about now like what the hell in between like you, you got, oh ye of little faith you know you like you like you, oh god can't be outside this box and whoop you know don't <laughs> man <laughs> I'm happy for you though, man, because we a rough, bumpy ride.